What is up guys, it is Zebra here, bringing you yet another battle, and this battle will probably be better than the other battles I'm doing. So let's run around, let's go see Cynthia, and you know, check them out, and then do some um, 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 in the back, yeah, whatever guys. But uh, yeah, this battle is going to be up against Paintball Rules, this was uh, a roulette match, which turned out to be a lot of fun. Um, yeah, it was, it was a pretty fun match, I got to use some pokes that I hardly ever use, but you know, we saw all that shit. So he's going to lead off with uh, Beedrill, and I got a fair, uh, I'm going to lead off with Christy Alley, and that's my Tabune, or Audino, and I talked about that poke earlier, and I was like, man, that poke's shit, and I used it in this match, and I still stand by that. But uh, I switched because I know this Beedrill's either going to want to go for a status or uh, set up, so I'm just going to go into my Feral Thorn, knowing I can pretty much take anything this thing wants to do. So he's just going to go ahead and set up two layers of Toxic Spikes as I set up my Rocks, and he's going to bring in a Vigor Roth, which is most likely Evo Stone. And he's going to get hit by a Gyro Ball on the Switch, which really doesn't do anything. And with the Evil Stone, so I'm guessing he's more on the bulkier side since he is going for bulk ups and shit. So I'm just going to go ahead and set up Leech Seed because I am physically defensive and I know I can live anything this thing wants to do because I don't run special defensive Notori. This is like a Notori I've had like since when Black and White first came out and I stabbed it. And I was like, oh, it's got awesome defense. Just put it all in defense and HP. But um, I'm going to hit with bulk up and he's going to, I mean, power whip and he lives because of the bulk up that's what i want to say but he dies the leech seed which is great so my notorious is looking pretty good back at half hp so he's going to bring in his no retard which is his uh landros and i'm not sure what he wanted to do I'm not sure if he was physical or special so i'm gonna bring in virigion since i know most of the ones that i've used is uh special attacking so i brought in virigion thinking i could take a hit uh a special hit but he it turns out to be a physical i'm guessing he's scarfed because later on he just yeah, I'm guessing he scarfed um, physical attacking, so he's just going for earthquakes. And I know I'm gonna die, so I'm just uh, uh, I will die eventually. So I'm just gonna hit it with Leaf Blade. It does good amount of damage since it is like neutral. But I'm gonna switch out since you know Virgil may prove to be useful later, and I know he's locked into earthquake. So I'm gonna bring in Pachi 2.0, which is my Amonga. And um, here I'm just gonna go straight for. Uh, what I thought was Hidden Power Ice, because I've never used Pachi 2.0 that much. I've only used them once, and I forgot what Hidden Power I have, but I'm guessing it's Water or something else that's resisted against uh, Roserade, so that didn't work out how I wanted it to. So I'm going to bring in um, a version I'm predicting, like a Sleep Powder, and, um, you know, since I'm poisoned, you know, it's cool. So I know I can at least get one hit off him before I die, just to think see what it is. I thought he might be a little faster because he's probably invested in speed, but uh, probably not since it wasn't a... well, can't get leads in. Leads designated for you in roulettes, but whatever. Um, x Scissor non-stab, doesn't really do much since I, I don't really have much invested into attack and I am a sword dancing set. It still does a good amount of damage, but not great enough. But I do end up living, so that means I can get one more x Scissor off. But uh, he's just gonna go ahead and send in PREPARE! And it's, it's a zap ghost, and you know, it's gonna take an x Scissor. And it's going to take it fine. It's going to do like 20 HP, I think. I don't know. It does a ridiculously low amount of damage. But whatever. That's fine. So, um... I'm just going to end up dying to Toxic. Whatever. I'm going to um, go ahead and bring in my Monga. And uh, I am Choice Spec. So, and I am Timid. So I know I'll outspeed. And plus, I think Amonga's base speed is already higher than Zapdos. But I'm going to go for Discharge. Get the Paralyzed. But he has a Lumberry, and I'm like, who runs Lumberry on, you know, Zapdos? And I was like, crap. So he's going to go for a sub with however little much HP he had left, and it's going to leave him with, like, none. And I was like, alright, hit him with the Discharge. I want to break the sub so I can bring in something to, like, revenge kill this thing, because, you know, whatever. So, But he ends up going for Agility, and I was like, shit, now I'm going to get swept, because this thing has, um... He's going to be faster than, like, all of my pokes. So, but he ends up baton passing. I was like, wait, what? Why would you baton pass on a near dead Zapdos when he I have rocks up? But whatever. He um, baton passes into Landoros and discharge doesn't affect. So I'm going to switch into my Christy Alley again since she is at full HP. And I think I am physic more physically defensive and max HP. And he's just going to go for the explosion. And since it sucks in 5th gen, it's not going to kill me. It's, I think it's going to be do around a little less than half. I mean, a little over half. And Christy Alley takes it fine. So, he's going to send out this uh, prepare, and it's going to prepare to die from Stealth Rocks, and it dies. So, Zapdos is gone, and now he's going to send in Lavana, which I guess is that's its name. It's that Bug Grass Poke. And I'm like, okay, maybe I can live any attack that this thing wants to do. So, I'm just going to go for the Wish, just to get my HP up. And I'm just hoping, like, toxic damage doesn't rank up enough to where it kills me. But, you know, I live. That's great. So, I'm obviously going to go for protect to get my HP, like, up to full. And 
I don't see that this thing has. A, I don't see an item kicking in. I was either thinking maybe it might be focus ash, but maybe more on the choice side. So I get a decent. I get. I get a good amount of HP back, and I'm gonna go ahead and uh, switch out since toxic damage is starting to rack up a bit. But you know, Cristiali is kind of useless. But I'm gonna bring in Blitzen because it seems like he's locked in the Leaf Blade, and that way I could get the Sap Zipper ability and you know boost my attack because this is my choice banded uh, Blitzen. It's the only Blitzen I have. I think, yeah, this is the only one I have. So I'm gonna go for the Mega Horn, and I miss. And I'm gonna die to X. Oh, I guess it is Focus Sash, because uh, he, he does X Scissor and kills me. Um, so yeah, he's probably X Scissor, and that, you know, that's gonna kill me. And I was like, son of a bitch. So I'm bringing Pachi 2.0, and I know I'm I'll obviously out speed, because I am timid, and Pachi or Imonga is fast. I'm just gonna go ahead and lock in myself into Air Slash, since his, la his last three things are that, the Beedrill, and uh, Roserade. And I know. Uh, uh, Imonga can end up just cleaning house with the rest of these pokes. So I'm gonna finish off Beedrill with uh, Choice Specs, Air Slash, and he's gonna bring in Roserade. And that thing's just gonna take a Choice Specs, Air Slash, and it's gonna die. So um, that was a great, that was a fun game. Uh, Paintball Rolls is. I haven't done a roulette in like for like f what seems like forever. But yeah, uh, I was streaming and I was looking for battles, and then like. He was the first battle of the stream, and the only battle of that stream, because my R4 decided to die. So I threw it against the wall, and now it doesn't want to work. So, um, here's the link to Paintball Rolls channel. Just click on the paint splatter, since he loves paintballs. But, you know, whatever. Uh, there's a link to his channel. He's a really cool guy. I've, I've always had a lot of fun matches with him. Um, he's got, he's, he uses some good pokes, and he has a lot of good, uh, matches up there. I'm, I know I'm in a, probably a few, but, you know, uh, me and him always have some fun matches. So, you know, make sure you check that out, and all that good stuff so <clears throat> uh, excuse me I think I might have put that up too long but yeah click paintballers channel go check that out and uh, here's the link to the last battle which was against our charge um, it was using the same team that I was using during fizzy stream and you know that was a fun match and uh, the last two matches with that team have been pretty short cuz I think it's cuz Brave burning the fuck out of everything just guarantee guarantees you a quick, easy win if they have nothing to do to it. But, you know, whatever. And it's Draptor Dice here, but whatever. Uh, guys, you click that link, check that out. Um, and then, you know, there's Paintball Rules channels. Links will be in the description and all that shit. Um, Facebook and Twitter, Twitter will be in the description below, too. You can check that out also. But, you know, that's it's all good. Uh, just, you know, click all those good links and, you know, you check that out. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. I'm going to let this play out and let the song go. Um, hope you guys uh, have a... Well, I'll probably have another battle up. But uh, if this is the only battle you watch, I hope you have a great Memorial Day weekend. Um, if I don't have a battle up by then. But, yeah, I hope you guys have a great Memorial Day weekend. And, you know, have lots of fun. And, you know, actually go outside. I know I'll, I'll be out. But, uh, yeah. Um, other than that, guys, uh, like, comment, subscribe. And I'll catch you guys later. Cheers.